believe that there is such a thing as fate and I was born into some kind of fate. No, not at all. I'm aware that fate is something that's part of Islamic understanding, but for Christians it's not on our radar at all. And, and my view would be that it's a notion that doesn't have any substance, it's not something that Christian people would take seriously in any way, believing that yes there are issues that affect what happens and how people behave and what transpires, but it's nothing to do with fate. I believe in fate in a certain aspect of life, but I don't think that it actually maps out your life for you. I mean, you're born when you are born. I don't think fate has anything to do with that. It's all part of the, the circle of life process. You come to certain crossroads in your life and you make decisions and you take those routes. Sometimes it can be fate related, but it's your own decisions that actually take you to your destiny, your journey. I think we're all destined for certain things within our lives, but I think you, you go through lessons and if you don't learn from it, you go back to square one. But if you keep going down the right path, you actually find your natural path in life. So I do believe we're fated, but I think we could also change our fate. I believe it's nature versus nurture. The person can change their circumstances in life if they're given the opportunities. N nature has an effect on your DNA, your personality, but where you end up in life should be down to nurture. I think it depends with the character you are because you, you, you can have your parents or whatever can teach you what they think is right but you might go along as you go along you find well they're not totally right it's just what they've been taught by their parents and so but as we evolve we learn different things and things change. My generation to the last generation are two completely different monsters so to speak. I suspect that upbringing has an awful lot to play in it and, and that what people are told and what they don't question would be what pro they probably go through life with until and unless somebody forces them to challenge it. I believe it's constructed over time. You get to a certain point in your life you have to make decisions. For example, when you leave school, do you go to college? Do you try and get into work? immediately. If you take one route you don't know where the other route would have led in the end. You know you're building your fate and you're constructing your own destiny so to speak. From a negative aspect I believe you can change it into a positive aspect. And I also believe if, you, if, you, if you're going down a positive path people self-destruct and can go down a negative path. I mean it's constructive, it's what, what you put into it you're going to sort of get out of it as you, you, you reflect the, the society or the people you, you associate with. I find it very hard to, to, to say whether fate is something you construct yourself or whether it's permanent because I don't actually think, personally as a Christian, that it exists anyway. Uh, I think it's a way that people use to, to explain circumstances. If I were to give you in one word what I think about fate, it is rubbish. Superstitious. Destiny. Your choice. Two words. Fate is your choice. Fate is you. You. You are fate. I mean, this is this is what we are. We are here. And, you know, we're all going somewhere. It just depends the way you want to go.